I know you're trying to get people to be cautious there, but why should I not be excited about fighting a robot? You would lose. Well, OK, to start, we don't know that, do we? We don't know that for sure, because what could a robot do that I couldn't then fight back with by simply just unplugging him, right? There's a story that scientists built an intelligent computer. The first question they asked it was, is there a god? The computer replied, there is now, and a bolt of lightning struck the plug, so it couldn't be turned off. Holy shit, that's the most terrifying story I've ever heard. Yes. Hold on. Who is talking to me right now? Is it you, or is it a sentient computer pretending to talk on your behalf? It's me. Yeah, but how do I know that, Professor? Because if computers had become sentient, what better way to convince people they hadn't than by co-opting the voice of the most intelligent man on the planet? You're an idiot. Yeah, but who's saying that, Stephen? You or the machine? Both of us. OK, all right. Are the following things technically possible? Life on other planets, is that theoretically possible? Yes. OK, uh, what about a Schwarzschild wormhole? Yes. OK, what about this? Uh, me going on a date with Charlize Theron? No. Well, not at all? In, in no universe? No. In, in none of the infinite universes does that happen? No. It's completely beyond the bounds of scientific possibility, is what you're saying? Yes. Uh,